Did you guys know that your pancreas is actually drained by two different ducts? Let's take a look at it. So this here is your pancreas, and the pancreas sits within the 180 degree turn of the duodenum. So we have pancreas here, duodenum here, this is the liver up here, and then the gallbladder. Now the pancreas is really mostly drained by this duct here, which is known as the main pancreatic duct. It's also known as the duct of Worsung. And the duct of Worsung, or the main pancreatic duct, drains into the ampullia vader that also drains the common bile duct. So here you have common bile duct. So this right here, this is your common bile duct, your main pancreatic duct, and both of those drain into the ampullia vader. Now that drains into the duodenum via the major duodenal papilla, which is this structure right here. This other duct, this one here, this is the accessory duct of the pancreas, and it helps drain the head of the pancreas, and it helps relieve pressure to help prevent pancreatitis. Now, this is also known as the duct of Santorini. So you have the accessory duct, or duct of Santorini, and it drains into the duodenum via the minor duodenal papillae. So we have liver, gallbladder, cystic duct, common bile duct, main pancreatic duct, or duct of Worsung, the hepatopancreatic ampulla, or ampullia vader, major duodenal papillae, the accessory duct, or duct of Santorini, and minor duodenal papillae. Now you know. Later.